Hi, I'm Caroline Mafu, the CEO of the Grace Kennedy Foundation. Super excited that we're out here right beside the Raytown Fishing Village with a team of volunteers, over 80 persons here this morning, uh, many from Grace Kennedy, uh, to help clean up the beach. We have the packages there, the free package for you. So we have black bag for what? It's part of a, a larger project we have, our Kingston Harbour Cleanup Project, which is being funded by the Ocean Cleanup and the Benioff Foundation. And it's just a way of one, trying to keep our beaches clean, and two, trying to get some data as to what kind of pollution is coming on our beaches. And thirdly, to create much more awareness about the issues facing pollution um, from the gullies that are then polluting the beaches. Every time we have our volunteers coming out, it's an opportunity for them to spread the word about the fact that we've got to stop dumping in our gullies. It's actually our third project. So our first was at Kingston Pen, the second was at Sigourney, and now we are by the Raytown Fishing Village to the left of it. And actually love the vibe, love to see the feeling, you know, especially cleaning up the shores because one thing that I've realized is so much plastic on our shores. I am a product of Raytown. This is where I grew up as a child. And um, I have a little micro business on Paradise Street. So I'm always involved in things that's happening in the community. I'm also part of the CDC. So this gave me an opportunity to help keep the environment clean as well as keep my community clean. I, I, I dislike the way it is, and I'm hoping I can help make a difference. Be a difference. Today I think our team saw an actual fish, and you would, you would see that it was because of what he encountered in the water while he died. So it was really sad. Um, but we're happy to be here helping to clear things up and to see how we can play our part in making things better. Not just for us, but for our children. I think we all accept that a lot of what we learn um, as kids, you know, carries through. So for me, it's important for my son to say that I didn't throw any garbage into a gully or a waterway, but I'm willing to do my part in cleaning up. So my hope is that it will stir the spirit of volunteerism in him and uh, the consciousness of how actions impact the environment. I see it as a good opportunity to represent my community and also to to be involved, to show the country, to show my community that I care. I care about what's happening here. We do this cleanup monthly. What's exciting to me, particularly today, is the fact that uh, I passed the JN Foundation team um, further down the beach, also doing a cleanup. So it's very exciting to see other corporate entities coming out, bringing out their teams, and that's really what we want to encourage. We want to encourage all of the private sector, community groups, to keep working at cleaning up the beaches but also talking about the issues because the more we highlight the issues and the pollution is the more we can hopefully effect change in how people behave and how people dump in the gullies and what cleanup strategies exist for waste so that we don't continually have this problem.